This game is T and is not suitable for kids. Hey there, buddy! Boot it up. We continue. We have defeated nine colossi in under four hours. In under five hours. Cool. I have no idea how good that is. <laughs> We've also found a couple of the unlockable stuff too. This is taking a while to load. I know it's a big world with amazing graphics, but still. Ah, here we are. Back, back again. Okay, guys, I feel a little uncomfortable when you all stare at me while I'm unconscious. It seems a little unnecessary. Ooh. I don't know how all these rock statues are collapsing just because we kill some giants in a far-off area, but I'll take it. Alright, Nimrod. What are we doing now? Oh, that's right! We're going to the desert! Tracks are well hidden, huh? Oh, is, is this going to be a giant snake? It's kind of what the statue looked like. We're fighting Jafar? This is going to be good. Alright, well... I guess we're off. Agro didn't come to greet me. Oh, there you are. Don't walk up the stairs. Just wait for me down here. Alright, aggro. Let's go! Hee-yaw! Okay, we've already been to a desert. I'm not sure if it's the same desert we need to go to, but... I'm at least gonna head over where the light shines. Oh, wait. Did I do this wrong? Aggro... We, oh, shoot. Nope. This is the wrong way. I didn't realize that there was going to be a gorge over there. hee -yaw. Agro, why did you move to the right? There was literally nothing over to the left. At all. Nothing. Zero zip zilch. <laughs> I think what really happened with Shadow of the Colossus is they're like, we want to make this cool cinematic movie. And, like, I don't know, Lord of the Rings was coming out at around the same time. They're like, oh, we can't compete with that. So, like, I know, we'll make it a video game. Even though that's, like, way more work. Because it really feels like this game is, like, emphasizing, like, look how cool everything looks. It's like, yeah, it definitely does. But I would have preferred slightly more refined gameplay. But, hey, this is still fantastic. Aggro, yeah. stop losing speed. You're a horse. Horses are able to ride through anything, right? Like I said, it is a beautiful game. Uh-oh, storm's coming. Now comes the part of the stream where we just ride horseback for, like, five minutes while we ride to the next area of the Colossus. Why does it take grip just to hold your sword up? Wow, th thank you, Skyrim Horse. I appreciate it. They said there was a desert over here, but man. We've been riding for a long time, and there's still no desert. I 
Aggro. I don't care if you are tired. You can rest while I kill the Colossus. This is how it works. Aggro's like, but then I have to ride back all by myself. Because the game doesn't teleport... Game doesn't teleport Aggro back. Game only teleports me back. And then Aggro has to just be great. Now I gotta ride all the way back to the temple. So that the main character can go and ride me again to a different area. All the while, I'm dehydrated and starving. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. This screams suspicious. Aggro? Move down. Alright, fine, Aggro. I don't need you. This place looks super suspicious. I can't even tell if this is a shrine that we've... No, we haven't. Okay, there's there's the stupid little gecko lizard. Where'd he go? There he is. What is Aggro freaking out about? Aggro! You can ever come down here with me. Or, or shut up. <laughs> Artie's not a horse person. What? Did you butter your shoes before starting this like Yoshi did? Ag oh, hey, Agro, there you are. Agro, if you see a little gecko, please kill it for me. What do you mean I can't move while drawing a bowstring? I can do that in real life. This guy is super annoying! He just moves everywhere. And he's so fast, too. As soon as I reach him, he's just like, Alright, peace. Agro's running around in the field, wasting his energy again. Okay, this guy definitely buttered his sandals before starting. Now, don't run up to the top again. Son of a lizard. Good camera. Cool. Still don't know if that's actually going to be worthwhile in the long run, but there we go. Oh, hey! This is the cave entrance that teleports us around, isn't it? Come, Aggro. We ride again. Wait. Oh, are we supposed to actually go through the teleporty cave to reach the desert? If so, that's kind of cool. Is that what it means when it says the path is well hidden? Because you literally just teleport? <sighs> that actually would make a lot of sense. Yeah, this is this is this is a pretty drastic change. Alright. This definitely looks like it's gonna be the arena for one There here we go. Alright. Snake Colossus? Is this going to be like the Mulgara or Twin Mold? Sure seems like it. Oh yeah. Yeah, it is like a, a desert snake. Hello there, friend. If you wouldn't mind so terribly, could I take your life today? Alright, aggro. I don't need you no more. 
Actually, I might need aggro again, but, well, he's here. Aggro's like, I will never leave your side. Oh my, ugh. Aggro's eyes are creepy. I know that's like how horse eyes look in real life, but... Oh. So you don't, you don't want to get hit by that. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, we, we are getting some Dune vibes here. Where'd he go? Where did Big Boy Snakey go? Uh-oh. Oh, that was game over, apparently. I'm not sure if it's because I suffocated getting buried by the sand... Or if I actually got hit and lost HP, but all right. I wonder if he's like tough and can sense vibrations in the sand. So it's like you don't want to move around a whole lot. Ouch. Oh my, what the heck? He just knocked out almost my entire HP bar. Oh, lord. Okay. There doesn't look to be a whole lot we can do with the architecture around here. Okay, I can't even, I'm trying to, like, jump and grab onto him as he passes by, but that that is not working. If I get even close to him, it's just like, you lose all your health. Okay, this is going to be a toughie. Maybe I do need to ride aggro. Maybe we ride aggro to avoid him, and we shoot him with the bow, and I can knock him out. Okay, I, I literally need, like, three hands in order to do this properly. Like, I need one hand to control aggro, one hand to hold the buttons to make aggro move and notch the bow, and then another hand to actually move it around. So taking a while to switch between my weapons. Maybe I can lure him into, like, a rock. I don't know how big the rock would need to be, but maybe if, like, I'm like, look here, I'm over here. Okay, nope, he did not care about the rock at all. And we are not fast enough to avoid him, so we're going to need to use aggro. Great. We have to use the badly controlled horse. Thank goodness aggro can still run fast in the sand. Okay, what if we lure him into one of these giant rocks? That is not the direction I thought you were going to be in. Did I just shoot aggro on the head? I truly did not mean to do that. 
You know, he's doing a good job of avoiding the big boy rocks. Hmm. Okay, I wonder, can I climb, can I climb this? It's one of those rocks where, like, it looks like I should be able to climb it, but it's like, nope. Okay, so he's able to sense there are these giant rocks here and is avoiding them. Interesting. Hmm. I wonder if there are... Like maybe I could climb that rock over there? Oh, hi. I, I am aware. That's why I'm using the horse buddy, but I'm still confused as to, you know, how we can actually deal damage to him outside of just shooting him very slowly with the bow. Okay, we cannot get near him. He's literally moving the sand so fast, and if we touch the sand when he's near it, we just die, pretty much. Great, so... How can we grab onto him if we can't even get near him. Does he follow us out of the arena? Oh, what the? That was a new one. Unfortunately, the camera sucks, so I couldn't even get out of the exit, because when I got near, they are like, Oh, let's turn you away from the exit so you can't actually see it. Actually, I can't fire the bow when I'm on horseback. That's like freaking impossible. <laughs> Oh, Aggro just is like, I'm not leaving. That is a problem. Okay, if we can get him to follow us and be like, Bruh! Into one of the rocks. That's probably going to be our key. Where did he go? We seem to get this weird cinematic anytime we go near the exit. Okay. I feel like I'm doing something right where he's chasing me. I just don't know how to kind of cinch the deal. Maybe I can shoot him in the eyes? If the camera cooperates, I might be able to do that. Where'd he go, though? Oh. The annoying thing is when the camera turns around, I can't see where I'm going. And when I'm aiming with the bow, I can't move aggro at the same time. Because that requires multi more hands than any human has.
That's it. I think. That looked like he was gonna collapse when I shot him in the eye, but then he didn't. Wait. Wait, what just happened? Was that just like the biggest delay ever with registering that he got hit? Also, where is he? I can't see where he is. Where is he? Could I have like a radar to see where he is? He's gonna knock us off. See, I like this fight's cool. I still don't know how we knocked him down in the first place. I'm gonna assume it was shooting him in the eye. But if so, this is a fight where aggro's actually really good. Is aggro still well we also stunned him apparently I can't believe aggro survived that he got bodied by the Colossus Stabby, stabby! Ooh! Okay, that was a pretty cool fight. Could have been implemented a little bit better, but... Definitely an awesome one. I like how aggro actually comes in clutch in that fight. You okay, aggro? No! Now Agro has to find his way back home again. That was really cool, though. Very cool fight. Very atmospheric. 